Okay, for today's video, I'm gonna show you how to repair a crack on my uh, on the uh, trash can. You see right there. Let me lay it sideways so you can see the uh, area that I repair. All right, so I lay it sideways so as you can see the crack right there that I repair. Okay, um, when I came home one day, the trash can was laid sideways like that, and uh, I take a look at it and. Uh, I noticed they have a crack right here. It's about two or three inches. Um, so I tried to repair it with uh, super glue and baking soda. Um, and it doesn't work. Uh, JB Well doesn't work. Anyway, the crack, uh, it, you know, it's, it, it's worked like maybe one or two uh, weeks and then it start come off and it start cracking again. So by the time it's done, it's about nine inches. Uh, the crack grow about nine inches so uh, what I did is uh, I was gonna drill a hole through here and uh, put a metal plate okay but uh, I saw this trick on uh, YouTube the guy uh, repairing kayak uh, and so uh, I'm, I'm gonna show you how so I test this out it's been six trash day now so six weeks and as you can see is the crack is you know uh, look like it's holding really well so I'm going to share this technique with you okay so all you need is a heat gun okay there's a there's a heat gun um, I got this Home Depot a while back and um, a flat screwdriver as you can see uh, the plastic of this repair is still on that screwdriver and uh, this is a screening material um, that you find on your window okay I just happen to have an old window I don't use it been sitting in my backyard. Uh, I don't know what material this is, but it's kind of like insect screen, your window. Um, I noticed there's two types, right? One of them made out of steel material. Uh, this one here, I don't know, look like it may be fiber, okay? So anyway, what you want to do is um, cut a piece, that's, uh, leave it about two inch, uh, you know, vertical and horizontal from the crack. All right and um, what I do first is I take the heat gun and I just heat it now depend on how hot your heat gun is you heat it and I check it about 20 seconds to start see this thing melt so when it start to melt you take a screwdriver and you just wedge it the two crack together all right do it uh, on the outside and on the inside on the inside it's a little harder because it's a confined space, right? Um, so you have to wear um, goggle and of course uh, some type of respirator uh, because uh, when you heat up this thing and give out a fume, okay? The inside there, it may sting your eye. So be careful with that. Put the screen on. So the trick of this is do it in one area, okay? You take a heat gun and you heat it up. When this thing melt, you just tap it on there. And then, uh, and then you're gonna see this screen gonna attach itself to it. Once it's attached, and then you start moving either downward or sideways. Okay, and you heat it up so hot that this thing, you can see, it melt. It look like it's become part of the plastic. See, see it on the inside there, and you can see this thing like sink into the plastic. Okay, but do a light tap. Okay, don't poke a hole. Do a light tap and allow that thing to sink in as you as you um, you know use a heat gun and heat it up so on the outside is really easy okay uh, you just go uh, go by it and um, these corner here have to be tucked in really well otherwise it's gonna come off okay so uh, you do that on the outside and on the inside and uh, this this right there is uh, look like look like it's holding for um, by uh, six trash day now. I mean, I've, I've been waiting for six weeks to see how this thing hold up and look like it's an excellent repair. Okay. Okay. So as you can see, when I stand it up, and if you look at it, you know, yeah. Okay. It look look. Uh, you know, it's not perfect, but it look like that screen become uh, part of that plastic there. Okay. So I do this on both. Uh, outside and inside too. Let me show you. Yeah, right there. Okay, 
So I do it both the outside and the inside. And so far, this uh, holds up very well. I hope this video helpful. Uh, thank you for watching and have a wonderful day. Bye.